Hi guys, welcome to probably gonna be a really short video, but since I never post and I feel like I should, because you know I'm such an amazing vlogger, all oh, that. Um, bro, this is a weird angle. Steering wheel things. Okay. That, okay. Okay. Literally, oh, I threw it away. Okay, I literally got scammed today. Okay, here's the story. So I saw this coffee shop on TikTok, by the way, like I live in LA now. Yeah, whatever, so crazy. But I live in LA now and I saw this coffee shop on TikTok where they had like all these vintage cars. I, I think it was called the Motor Cafe. Don't remember, I'm calling them out right now, scammed. Cause okay, I saw the videos on TikTok and it was like a cafe where they had like vintage cars. And I was like, oh, I love vintage cars. I'm gonna go check that out. And I was gonna make like a little TikTok being like, yes guys, like my life is so great. You know, I live in LA and I'm at this like vintage coffee shop. Right? And so I go, I get my coffee, $5 for freaking coffee. Could have got more at Starbucks, TBH. And then I got my pastry, so it's like eleven dollars total, eleven fifty, right? And so I was like, hey, wait, you know, whatever. And then I noticed that there's all these like boundaries around, uh, like where the cars are, and I'm like, that's weird. And there was like a little door, and it said members only, and I was like, members like the people who work here, like you know. So I, I just like was like, hmm, that's weird. I was like, I guess I'll have to ask. And so I sat down, like when I got my coffee, and I was kind of like. It was average. That's it was average. Let's be real. Five dollars for freaking like ca cappuccino, cappuccino that tall. Well, average. Hey, LA prices, I guess you know. But um, yeah. So I had that. I had my little like pan chocolat. Je ouh, oui oui baguette. Bien sûr. I'm saying that right, French people. I had that, and then I like sat down, ate it, whatever, and then I was like. Okay, I, like, I don't want to ask. Like, I saw someone go through the door, but I was, like, scared to go through by myself. So I was like, um, let me just, let me just ask really quick. So I asked. I was like, oh, like, how can I, like, get back there to, like, see the cars? And I said, like, really nice. I was like, hello, hi. How, um, I was wondering how I could get back there to see the cars. And they were like, oh, so you actually have to be a member. It's $95 a month. And I was like, are you freaking serious? I was like, I'm not gonna pay $95 a month to go look at cars. Like, even if I pay that now, like, and he was like, the guy was like nice or whatever, but he was like, oh yeah, like, it's only, um, you get like discounts and stuff. And I was like, like, I guess like they gotta make money somehow, you know? But still, I was thinking like, you know, maybe with like, you know, <coughs> five dollar entry fee something 15 20 i still would not paid it maybe it was like five dollars man okay or like purchase necessary like go see the cars you know like i get it it's like a business like they can't just like sell coffee and then own all these vintage cars like you know what i mean like eh, i understand that like, that's not really a profit but still 95 dollars a month to go look at some cars and i was like scammed because i kept seeing it on tiktoks and people were just like walking back there so i was like Oh, it must be free and then i saw like the blockage and i was like oh maybe i have to go through like a separate entrance because i saw there was like another door like when i was driving like next to it and literally yeah 95 bucks and i was pretty mad and so i was like oh okay thank you and then i left because i was like I'm, like 95 dollars and then i <sighs> could have just gone to starbucks honestly because they had some in like the area where like the coffee was but it was like not that cool it's like a motorcycle and then like two cars and like it was like a jeep and i was like oh I was like, where's the Ferrari? Where's the Lamborghini? Ferrari? Lamborghini. You make the best cars in the world. You know? So, yeah. I feel very scammed and I wait, feel like I spent $5 on a freaking cappuccino. That was literally like a small cappuccino like this big for nothing. So, that's my rant. That's my scam story. But, love, love this. <laughs> Okay, I want to add something else. Um, this is random, but I thought I'd include my thoughts, but I really craving a shrimp burrito right now. So, guys, uh, pray for me somehow in the past that um, I get a shrimp burrito because I really want one. And yeah. So, yeah. Also, out of the coffee shop thing, I'm just glad I didn't have to pay for parking. Because if I paid for parking and like the freaking um, like cappuccino and like pan chocolate, 
I would've been like pissed off. I'm like, bro, I paid for parking for what? Cause I hate paying for parking. Especially like in LA, I feel like you have to pay everywhere. Cause like where I'm from, like you do not have to pay for parking anywhere. And literally like, I had one incident where I was in Santa Monica and I was trying to go to this like the cyborg for like my cyborg account rating. And literally you had to like valet your car in the parking lot. And I was like, I was like, I'm not doing that. <laughs> Sorry. So yeah. So interesting things. So if you come to LA, know that you're probably gonna have to pay to park somewhere. Like <laughs> it's probably gonna happen, but yeah. Hi guys. I got my burrito. Also, today I literally so many times thought I was like gonna get in a car accident or die because LA driving is literally so crazy because I there were so many times where a car like hit me and I was like like there was so like if people are watching this you're not from LA so in parts of LA there's like kind of like a third lane but you park there if that makes sense it's like a third lane but like it's also like a parking spot um like street parking and literally this car like this huge like forerunner I'll put a picture it literally like went in the third lane and like around me and I was like like more like this I was like I think this car's gonna hit me and I literally was like I'm gonna die and like I feel like it's kind of like older than like where I'm from so the streets are like I feel like are very thin so I get very anxious driving down because I'm very spatially anxious like that's why I have Mini Cooper because it's my that's why I like my car because it's so small that I can just like don't worry about it I'm just like do 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 and then I can fit in these spaces easily I'm literally like I was scared, but I did get my burrito though. Shrimp burrito.